Yeah, so uh, this is a particular instrument that we want to talk about. It's the harmonica, and it's now being studied uh, in patients with COPD. So if you're unfamiliar, that is chronic obstructive pulmonary disease. It's associated with smoking. Uh, this is a progressive and severe problem that damages the lungs and really makes it hard to exhale and get the carbon dioxide out of your lungs. So now studies show the harmonica may be the key to breathing easier. All right, we will do us some home on the range. It's 72 years young. John Moberly is a reminder that it's never too late to try something new. I've met some wonderful people. His latest hobby, the harmonica. It's certainly been a lot of fun. But this isn't just for fun. John has COPD. It makes every breath you take a struggle. Very nice. That felt better. Music therapists think the harmonica may help. The reason the harmonica was chosen is because it offers resistance. Each little hole on the harmonica is two pitches, so you have to make a sound by blowing out using a technique called purse lip breathing that our COPD patients learn when they're in rehab because it, it it's more efficient to clear out the lungs. No one's really studied it. While programs like this do exist across the country, Baylor researchers are the first to study the effects of harmonica playing for COPD patients. You do not have to read music. You do not have to have any kind of musical background, be able to play an instrument. Patients in the study do have COPD, are older than 45, have smoked for at least 10 10 years and have been through pulmonary rehab for at least six months. Researchers do a baseline breathing evaluation, test patients again at 12 weeks, then at six months, measuring lung function, muscle strength, and how far they can walk in six minutes. So far, we have seen some significant improvement in these patients. Good old John is holding out for his results. Too early to tell. Once the evaluation is done, then we'll know. In the meantime, He'll keep practicing. Now, I know they look innocent, but these folks call themselves the Harmaniacs. <laughs> they put on one heck of a performance as well. To hear more, you can log on to WFAA.com. We got some stuff there for you. Uh, you can also find more information on the Better Breathers Club. And we will, of course, check back in with John next month for his final evaluation results.